The Adventures of Dee Dee La. Hello, 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 reptilians. As you can see, I am not Reptile 7. I am Dee Dee La, and Reptile 7 has asked me to show you a few things that I'm doing out here on the server. So, uh, one of the things we're going to do is look at this base of mine. So we'll see how I built that accordion base and also uh, just a few other things. So I hope you have fun today and let's get started. So here is what the cliff looked like before I built my base. We had a big waterfall there except for this platform. Uh, this is the platform that I built uh, to start building. You can see me standing there. This I'm just sh showing you a little bit in replay, but you'll see that there's all this stuff. There is no way I went to the nether to get all that material of netherrack and blackstone. Thanks to Terralith, this whole mountain is filled with blackstone and netherrack, and you could probably see down here the uh, the magma cubes I used and the backside over here has all kinds of sand. So uh, that's where I got all the stuff, all my materials. But this is what it looked like, a big, huge open space before I started. And this is based on my own accordion. And I uh, wrote a little ditty to go along with the time lapse, just for the occasion. <laughs> Just a little bit. I want to move back because you might have missed something. Just rewind just a bit. This guy right here. Now he was hiding there and I came down the stairs and look, he's right there. And then all of a sudden, zoop, one shot right to the leg. And I don't even know what's going on. I'm such a noob here. Second shot right to the head. Look, I'm switching my stuff. What am I going to do? Hit him with a block of cobblestone. So I'm just swinging whatever I got in my hand there. I think it went back to my pickaxe. And he's got one, two, another shot right there. And finally, he just goes off the edge. And poor Didi La with five arrows sticking out of him. Somehow, I ended up surviving that. So let's get back to the build. <laughs> So we're just going to head on, uh, there's the base over there. We're going to head on back to, what is that? Is that, a, is that a fox? Hey, hey fox, what are you doing out here? Come on, do you want to get in my boat? Come on, get in my boat, fox. Come on, you can do it. Hey, oh, I guess not. All right, well, I think I got a lead here. Yeah, here we go. All right, so I guess we'll just um, take you on back to the base and we'll have a nice uh, leisurely row on the lake with a um, uh, fox running behind us. So I know I hear you. I, I don't know why this surprises me though, because I, I saw a chicken running out on the ocean the other day and I seem to be the only one who sees these things. But anyway, so I'm gonna take you back. Um, build you a little pen and yeah that should be cool we'll build you a pen and oh now you're gonna get in the boat get out of there come on get out get out of there all right there we go all right so let's um head on up and we'll build you a nice little pen okay uh, so this is my skeleton horse look you'll see i named him alas poor yorick oh my skeleton horse <laughs> i got him after dying several times defeating the three skeletons on horseback but anyway so i tamed him i got a saddle on him trying him out here get him for a little ride there i am on my horse 
I'm gonna take him for a little ride here. Come on, go, go. Yeah. Now that's cool. What could be cooler than riding a skeleton horse? All right, so here we've got Cat C with me, and uh, we're going to take a little adventure with our llama. We we got him. He was just on uh, Reptile Seven's mountain. He there was no wandering trader with him. He was just there alone. So we tamed him, and so now what we're going to do is we're going to take him uh, boat jumping. So we're going to climb up the cliff up this uh, stairway that I built all the way in the cliff. We're gonna fast forward through it. See here, you can see all that extra terolith. We're climbing up to the top of the mountain here. And <laughs> here we could not get this llama in the boat. He just, he wouldn't go in. So this is all the time we spent trying to get the llama in the boat. Uh, Reptile 7 joined us. All right, so now we're ready and we're all set. We're gonna take this boat off and see what happens. Here we go, one, two, three, Go! There it is, coming down. And here we hit, look at that. It's like a padded landing. And is everyone okay? All right, so I'm gonna show you some of the animals that we have here uh, that I have had named. Where are you? So over here in the alpaca pen, we got lots of alpaca. There he is, Barack Obama. That is the one we took off the cliff, Barack Obama. Where are you, Barack? Stay in there, guys. There, there you are, Barack Obama. So now I'm gonna head over here and uh, look at our fox. That Remember that I found out on the water. And if I can get in there. If I can, there he is, Jesus. Hello, Jesus. <laughs> well, so let me, uh, you want a pork chop, Jesus? Yeah, let me see if I can give you a pork chop. Ready? Ready, go. Get that pork chop. Go get it. There he is. He's got a pork chop. Uh, I wish his face wasn't there. You can sort of see he's got a mouth. Okay, so there's Jesus, our water walking fox. And now I'm going to head back over. And I'll tell you this. I, my zombie horse despawned. I don't know how I had loved him and tamed him and pet him and hugged him and I even named him. I put a name tag on him. He had a last poor York and he was in this pen. He was even still tied up and he's not here anymore. So I've had other problems with uh, things despawning. I We traveled like 3,500 blocks one way searching for a jungle and we found one and I tamed two parrots and I got back and then they were gone. So anyway, now I'm gonna have this horse. Let me put, I'm gonna put a name tag on him. Look at that, can you see that? There he is. I just named him Reptile Seven and a Half. If we can get that there, Reptile Seven and a Half. So don't tell, don't tell Reptile Seven. I'm gonna put a, some horse armor on him. How do I do this? Okay, there we go. I'm gonna put my gold armor that I found in a remnant. Uh, sorry, in a by next to a ruined portal. So, so there you go. So we'll see how long it takes Reptile Seven to notice that my horse is named Reptile Seven and a Half. <laughs>
this is my first ever build in Minecraft too, so I have to say I'm actually pretty proud of it. So now that the build's all done, I'm going to show you the way in, which the only way in is through the waterfall, either from the bottom or from the top. So you got to swim your way up here. And here we go. This is my glassed off uh, area. You can see all my chests over there. And you'll see I found my parrot. I went back to the jungle and he was there. He never, I don't know how he ended up there. So I'm hoping that um, maybe, alas, poor Yorick will magically reappear somewhere too. And there's my cat too. And so here is um, a view to the back in the hole. And so on the second floor we go up and whoops, I guess we don't go up. There we go. Second floor we go up and this is my enchanting room. And then we go up a little further and we get to my aquarium room. You can see there I've got a couple of fish. I'm going to put some more animals in here, but I haven't quite finished that yet. There's my axolotl. I haven't named them yet, but maybe I'll name him Reptile 7 and 3 quarters. <laughs> I don't know. Anyway, and so then up at the top, I have my uh, my bedroom, which you can also see my aquariums through the floor. And if we come up a little bit further, then we have the roof, which ouch, 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 ouch. That's intentional. And I'm planning on putting some other stuff up here. Uh, but so far, so good. No mobs. And that's a little tour of my base. So I hope you all enjoyed this video. We had at least a little bit of fun here, right? So <laughs> and thank you, Reptile7, for having me on. This is DD Law signing off. And maybe or maybe not, we'll see you again on... The Adventures of DD Law!